A number of services in northern parts of Singapore were knocked out after a fire broke out at Singtel's Bukit Panjang Exchange this afternoon. While some services have been restored, Singtel says its engineers will work through the night and expects all services to be restored by 6 a.m. tomorrow. This is where it all started. A fire in a cable room at this Singtel facility, which caused damage to the network infrastructure. Though the fire was put out in 20 minutes, it wreaked havoc on services that took much longer to restore. Singtel said some fixed voice lines, broadband and TV services in areas like Woodlands, Bukit Panjang, Chua Chu Kang, Upper Bukit Timah and Mandai were affected. Mobile services in parts of Woodlands, Marceling and Kranji were not spared. Telcos, Starhub and M1 were also affected. The Infocom Development Authority of Singapore said this could have impacted services that rely on these networks. It's currently investigating the issue. Banks like DBS said some of its ATMs and AXS services were affected and DBS said it extended operating hours of all branches today by an hour. A Singapore Pools draw had to be postponed till 9pm because of the incident. Retailers we spoke to said their customers couldn't pay using the network for electronic transfers or NETS cards. So wasted today that as customer actually wanted to buy my product, but due to the transactions of the next uh, machine cannot be connected, so she uh, put back my product. The Singapore Civil Defence Force is investigating the cause of the fire. Telco M1 was recently fined a record $1.5 million by IDA for service disruptions over four days in January this year.